today, we're going to talk about how to stop hooking the golf ball. And there's a few different reasons that you may hook the golf ball. Number one would be path. If your path is coming too far, if we're aiming this direction from the inside and we're scooping, that'll cause us to flip our hands and to scoop the golf ball. Also, when we take the golf club away, if we don't allow that toe to get up to the sky and we leave it closed on the way back, it's going to come into the golf ball and be very closed on the way down. So two quick tips to help your path and help you take the golf club away. First and foremost, a great drill for you is to take the golf club away and as you do and you turn, your checkpoint at your hip wants to be to see that that toe is facing somewhat to the sky. If the face of the club is facing the ground, we have issues here. So turn and allow the toe to face the sky. That'll help your club face position. Second thing is, how do we help our path? If you watch the tour players, even Tiger does this because he'll start to hook the golf ball. Instead of swinging straight back and swinging out from the inside, just like this, if we're somebody that hooks it, we're gonna do the exact opposite. I want you to swing it a little more to the inside and swing over the top like this. And I want you to take about 10 practice swings, changing your path a little more in this direction. This is gonna allow you to get to your front side a lot easier because your path is gonna come more down the line. And again, if you're somebody that hooks it, this is gonna help you dramatically to be able to get to your front side and hit the golf ball first. So again, set up, check your point right here to make sure the toe is somewhat near the sky. Give yourself a nice big feeling of how that path's gonna be. We'll get rid of that hook right away. We'll start hitting much more solid golf shots.